Hello, my name is Chris Winter, Interim Vice President of Student Life. I'd like to welcome you to the 2023 University of Oregon Honors and Awards. I'm so happy to be able to recognize you, some of our outstanding students today. The first award I would like to present is the Mary Hedjikovitz Freshman Award. This award goes to a first year student who has displayed a willingness to be involved in campus activities and who exemplifies academic excellence. This award includes a scholarship. The 2023 recipients are Eulakia Bupalam. Eulakia is a first year Robert D. Clark Honors College student from Beaverton, Oregon. She is currently double majoring in psychology and family and human services with a minor in global health. Eulakia has served on campus involvements with the student ambassador program, UO mock trial, and the student group South Asian Cultural Alliance. She loves attending the U of O and all of the amazing people she has met during her time at the university. She hopes to become a therapist for youth of color. Samantha Wisner. Sam is a first year student majoring in global studies with a minor in Middle Eastern North African studies. She is from San Jose, California and has greatly enjoyed her time at the University of Oregon. Sam works on campus as a student ambassador, participates in residence hall leadership, participates in Jewish life on campus, and sings in the Gospel Singers. Sam loves spending time outside, especially on sunny days, and exploring Eugene and all the U of O has to offer. She is extremely grateful for this award. Congratulations, Eulakia and Samantha. The second award today is the Vernon Barker Sophomore Award. This is awarded to the sophomore who best exemplifies academic excellence, university service, and good citizenship. The 2023 award recipient is Chloe Webster. Chloe is a second year stamp scholar in the Clark Honors College, studying planning, public policy and management, global studies, and French. She currently serves as a finance senator for the Associated Students of the University of Oregon, as well as house chair of the Herb Memorial Union Board. You may also see her giving tours around campus as a student ambassador, sharing her love for the U of O community. Above all, she loves meeting new people and engaging with the world, hoping to combine these passions and her degree for a career that benefits the world. Congratulations, Chloe. Next, I would like to announce our junior awards. The first of these is the Jim Buck Award, presented to a student who has demonstrated strong academic achievement and whose service has helped the university build relationships with prospective and or newly admitted students. This award includes a scholarship. The 2023 award recipient is Sophia Rambazadi. Sophia is a proud and honored SOJC duck and a first generation college student. She leads with comprehensive knowledge, passion, and a kind heartfelt nature in every part of her life. Her profound enthusiasm can be seen in her many involvements on campus. She is a member of the ambassador program and a presenter on the university's upstream AD team. Congratulations, Sophia. The Gerlinger Cup is awarded to an outstanding junior woman selected for scholarship, leadership, and service to the university. The 2023 recipient is Lucy Wesson. Lucy is a junior at U of O studying global studies, linguistics, and art. She spent six months studying abroad in Croatia and Rwanda, where she completed research projects on women's courts, art-based peace building, and women's economic development. Lucy served as her sorority's sexual violence prevention chair and has since testified in the Oregon State Legislature to improve institutional policy regarding sexual misconduct in higher education. Currently, she works as a legislative intern for the Oregon Student Association and strives to empower students to advocate for justice. Congratulations, Lucy. The Coil Cup is presented to a junior man who has shown the most progress in leadership, service, and academic achievement. The 2023 recipient is Cooper Manzion. Cooper is a third year business administration student from Salt Lake City, Utah. Cooper has a natural ability to connect with people and works in the U of O ambassador program. Cooper is a member of both the Warsaw Sports Business Club as well as the Oregon chapter of the National Society of Leadership and Success. Cooper loves the unique running and food culture of the University of Oregon and the city of Eugene. Congratulations to Cooper. The Best Templeton Christman Award is given to junior women exemplifying the outstanding qualities of leadership, scholarship, and service to others. This award includes a scholarship. The 2023 recipients are Sophie Fisher. Sophie is a junior at the University of Oregon where she studies neuroscience and chemistry. Sophie is a part of the Clark Honors College and an undergraduate researcher in the Grimes Lab 
a resident assistant, and a volunteer for the Student Sustainability Center's food justice programs. Sophie is interested in both STEM fields and public health, particularly in improving food security. Madeline Getz. Madeline is a third year anthropology major in the Clark Honors College with minors in global health, global service, disability studies, and science communication. She is a student ambassador in UO's visit programs and an undergraduate research assistant in the Global Health Biomarker Lab. She is the social media coordinator for the Museum of Natural and Cultural History Student Club, a member of the triathlon club sports team, and a violinist in our campus orchestra. Emma Kuntz. Emma has dedicated their academic and professional career to advancing equity. Studying planning, public policy, and management allowed Emma to work with nonprofit organizations, governments, and companies to combat social inequality. They developed a training course to help women and minorities at the UO find jobs, presented an award-winning social enterprise to support minority entrepreneurs and bring their voices into government, nonprofit, and corporate projects. Emma spent the fall of 2022 studying abroad in Spain and is currently studying abroad in Seoul National University in Seoul, Korea. Congratulations, Sophie, Madeline, and Emma. The Maurice Harold Hunter Leadership Scholarship is presented to a junior man from the state of Oregon who has made the most notable contributions through their own achievements and exhibited qualities of scholarship and leadership among their fellow students. This award includes a scholarship. The 2023 recipients are Marcel Brinkley. Marcel is from Milton Freewater, Oregon and has always been passionate about pursuing a career in business. Marcel is majoring in business administration with a concentration in sports business and operations and business analytics, while also pursuing a legal studies minor and working as a building operations assistant at the Lundquist College of Business. Stephen Ledendecker. Stephen was raised in Medford, Oregon. He transferred to the University of Oregon in the 2021 fall semester and majors in business administration with a concentration in operations and business analytics. Stephen has a deep passion for the game of baseball and hopes to utilize his analytical skill set to work in baseball and to tell a story of the game through numbers. He loves the outdoors and spending time with his family and friends and his German shepherd dog, Max. Spencer Rosenau. Spencer is from Oregon City, Oregon and majoring in political science and comparative literature. His research interests include U.S. foreign politics, disaster relief, climate change, and political rhetoric. He is passionate about student advocacy and is heavily involved with ASUO on its Contracts Finance Committee. Congratulations, Marcel, Stephen, and Spencer. Now I would like to announce our senior awards. The Paul Olam Award is presented to a graduating senior who best exemplifies academic excellence, dedication to the welfare of the university through involvement in campus activities, integrity, and concern for people. The 2023 recipient is Jake Heinonen. Jake is a graduating senior with a neuroscience major and minors in chemistry and biology. He is passionate about helping the homeless and is currently the president of Occupy Medical Nonprofit which provides free healthcare to the unhoused. Jake now runs two clubs on campus, the Hope Club and the Rural Health Club. Jake is a pre-med student and has enjoyed working as an EMT for Mid Valley Ambulance. He's also an active part of the research team in the Goldberg Lab in the Knight Campus. In his free time, he loves hiking and watching movies. Congratulations, Jake. The Ray Hawk Award is presented to a senior who by performance best exemplifies the essential qualities of leadership in university life and promise of later leadership as a citizen, high scholastic achievement, service to others in the university, and contributions to improving the quality of the undergraduate life at the university. The 2023 recipient is Irissa Mehta. Irissa has been serving as the Director of Advocacy and Philanthropy with the UO Student Alumni Association for the last two years. Within this role, Irissa fosters the relationships of Ducks Giving Back to Ducks through events and networking. Irissa has been involved in the ASUO since their first year at the UO and is now serving as the Student Body Senate President. Irissa was an intern for the Inside Out program and believes in promoting higher education for all. Congratulations, Irissa. The Wilson Cup is awarded to a senior student whose outstanding leadership and willingness to challenge conventional thought has stimulated awareness and fostered education in the areas of social and cultural issues. The 2023 recipient is Anjuli Mishra. 
Anjuli is a fourth year student studying sociology, political science, and ethnic studies. She fundamentally believes that every person deserves the resources and opportunities that they need to thrive and is particularly passionate about children and youth welfare. She has been an active member of the University of Oregon community through a number of UO-based organizations such as the Holden Center, First Year Programs, SAIL, the PEP, the Parking Citation Appeals Board, and Summer Bridge. In her free time, she enjoys learning languages, listening to music, and reading. Congratulations on Julie. The Fronmeyer Award is presented to a fifth year senior who sustains extensive campus and community service throughout their fifth year of study at the university. The 2023 recipient is Isabella Estrada. Isabella is a fifth year student from Los Angeles, California. She will be graduating with a Bachelor's of Science in Human Physiology and Anthropology this spring. Through her time as a student at the U of O, she worked as a FIG assistant, athletic training intern, and in the Center for Student Involvement. Isabella has also been a voice in the President's Student Advisory Council. After graduation, she will be attending CSU Fullerton for her Master of Science in Athletic Training. Congratulations, Isabella. I would now like to turn this over to Marcus Langford, our Dean of Students, to continue our award ceremony. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Marcus Langford, and I have the honor and privilege of serving as the Dean of Students within the Division of Student Life. I'm so pleased to be here with you today to celebrate your success and the outstanding leadership and service as the students who have contributed to the UO campus. Not only have you achieved academically, but you have made an impression on the community and campus culture. If you are one of the students being honored today, you should be immensely proud of your remarkable contributions to this campus. The first award I have the honor of presenting is our non-traditional student award, which recognizes the breadth and depth of experience and contributions made by a non-traditional student as they balance academics, other work, and family responsibilities. The 2023 recipients are Bryce Ariza. Bryce graduated from UO in spring 2022 with a BM in oboe performance and a BA in German and Scandinavian studies, and is now a graduate student pursuing a master's of music in music education. Throughout their education at UO, they have dedicated their time to advocate for the Division of Equity and Inclusion initiatives and have worked with the School of Music and Dance Committee for Equity and Inclusion to directly create lasting changes. Bryce hopes to become a high school band director where they can give students the same support system they received at the University of Oregon. Natalie Abele. Natalie is a concurrent MBA MSF student at the Lundquist College of Business, specializing in sports business. During her time at Oregon, Natalie has served as a student experience GE and held leadership roles within the MBA Student Association and the National MBA Sports Business Alliance. Her pursuit of dual graduate degrees stems from her desire to help grow women's professional sports and particularly to expand the WNBA and NWSL to Canada. She is originally from Toronto and has recently worked in partnership with the Portland Trailblazers. Chris Capron. Christopher is a third year doctoral student in the counseling psychology program. His research interests include examining the intersections of race, class, and health status on mental health and therapeutic outcomes, and he is particularly interested in developing short interventions to support Latinx adolescent mental health. At UO, he works as a trainee psychologist at the Child and Family Center. Rowan Glass. Rowan is a senior anthropology major with minors in Latin American studies and history. Rowan's thesis research concerns the ethnography of cultural reproduction and territorial autonomy among indigenous people of the Sabundoy Valley in Southwest Colombia. He's currently preparing to intern with several NGOs in Senegal this spring, where he hopes to develop similar research commitments. Apart from his research and travel interests, Rowan enjoys photography, documentary video, creative writing, and indie films. Congratulations, Bryce, Natalie, Chris, and Rowan. Next, I have the pleasure of presenting the Graduate and Doctoral Master Service Awards. These awards are given to students at the master's or doctoral levels to recognize their outstanding contribution to the university and larger community in both scholarship and leadership. The 2020 Doctoral Award recipient is Kiana Nodanza. 
Kiana is a sixth year doctoral candidate in the Department of Anthropology with a graduate specialization in Asian studies. They are also part of the Women's, Gender and Sexuality Studies graduate certificate program. Their dissertation research examines beauty pageantry as a cultural phenomenon in the Philippines with a specific interest in its relationships to colonization, gender and nationalism. Their research has been funded by their Winner Grand Foundation, the Department of Education's Fulbright Hayes Program, as well as the Center for the Study of Women in Society at the University of Oregon. After graduation, they hope to continue teaching in academia. Congratulations, Kiana. The 2023 Master's Award recipient is Caleb Beavers. Caleb is a second year master's student at the University of Oregon. He is an English major with a specialization in food studies. His academic work focuses on environmental humanities, health humanities, and human microbe relationships. When not at school, Caleb enjoys reading, cooking, baking bread, and going on walks. You can often find him at the UO's Urban Farm. Congratulations, Caleb. Next, it's my pleasure to present the John R. Moore Scholarship presented to students who excel in their contributions to the lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender community at the University of Oregon. This award includes a scholarship. The 2023 John R. Moore recipients are Rachel Perry. Rachel is a second year English master's student at the University of Oregon. Rachel's academic interests in performance studies, disability studies, queer theory, and pedagogy have propelled Rachel through this degree and into UO's MED program, UO Teach, this coming summer. When Rachel is not in class, Rachel can be found performing with UO's Shakespeare or the original practice Shakespeare Festival, running games of Monster Hearts for Friends, or doing the dishes after a good meal. Cass Weeks. Cass is a second year environmental science major at the University of Oregon. They are from a small town in Southern California. Identifying as a non-binary black lesbian woman, Cass has faced adversity and many setbacks during their time at the University of Oregon, yet has managed to come out stronger every time. Kiana Nadanza. Kiana is a sixth year doctoral candidate in the Department of Anthropology with a graduate specialization in Asian studies. They are also part of the Women's, Gender, and Sexuality Studies graduate certificate program. Their dissertation research examines beauty pageantry as a cultural phenomenon in the Philippines. After graduating, they hope to continue teaching in academia. Congratulations, Rachel, Cass, and Kiana. I will now announce the recipients of the 2023 Student Group Excellence Awards. The Student Group Excellence Awards were made possible by a generous gift from William D. Rutherford, UO Class of 1961, in collaboration with the EMU and ASUO. They recognize and reward UO student groups that best inspire and engage others, promote inclusion and diversity, and create a fun and positive environment. With many exceptional student groups on campus, the Student Group Excellence Awards are intended to recognize those whose work has had a positive impact on the UO community, as well as celebrate the group's success and further strengthen the group's mission, reach, and work. The 2023 Student Group Excellent Award categories and recipients are the New Student Organization of the Year Award, which goes to We the Ensemble for their incredible accomplishments as a newly established student organization. The Excellence and Community Impact Award, which goes to helping out people everywhere, or HOPE, for their extraordinary efforts to collaborate with both campus and community organizations to provide food assistance to the homeless community in the Eugene Springfield area. The Excellence and Creative Co-Sponsorships Award, which goes to the South Asian Cultural Alliance for actively promoting inter-club collaborations and working successfully with diverse groups on campus to create events that celebrate different cultures and intersections of identity. And finally, the Rutherford Outstanding Student Organization Award goes once again to We the Ensemble. It is extremely rare for a newly created student organization to receive this award. In the first year of the group's establishment, 
We the Ensemble has successfully collaborated with community organizations to bring music education to people with disabilities and underserved communities. Their efforts to advance for accessible music education among underserved populations and their achievements within the past year are truly outstanding. Please join me in congratulating all of these outstanding student groups. We are incredibly impressed with your contributions to the campus community and cannot wait to see what you accomplish in the future. The American Association of University Women Award is presented to senior women selected for outstanding achievements in the areas of service to the university, service to the community, and lifetime goals. The 2023 American Association of University of Women Award recipient is Debbie Davis. Debbie is a senior majoring in psychology and earning a certificate in secondary education. During her time at UO, she has worked at the Holden Center, was president of Alpha Phi Omega, and volunteered at local nonprofits and elementary schools. She is passionate about creating a more equitable education system for K-12 students. Next year, she will be serving as a city year member in Sacramento, California. Congratulations, Debbie. Next is the Dean's Award for Service. This award is given to students who have made exceptional contributions of service to the university community, fellow students, and the larger community. The 2023 recipients are Triquez Bridges, Jacob Campos, Caleb Cheronay, Chelsea Cortez Martinez, Naila Dowell, Kat Finseth, Mia Graves, Connor Hinkle, Bernice Hernandez Ojeda, Jennifer Linares Espinoza, Ella Malloy, Brady Paris, Tristan Phillips, Kate Reynolds, Chris Reeder, Macy Shering, Sharon Sherpa, Lauren Sims, Helen Ingram Tuttle, Gabby Vera, Cami Wilson, Henry Wool, Graham Yotsua. Congratulations to all of our Dean's Award recipients. Last, I will present the Centurion Awards given to undergraduate and graduate students for their dedication and outstanding service as student leaders in the past year. The 2023 recipients are Nayantara Aurora, Sadie Creamer, Sydney Hoy, Tabitha Knight, Annie Kuntz, Julia Lowe, Devin McLean, Aaron McGinnis, Claire O'Connor, John Michael Rennan, Lucy Roberts, Julia Rude, Nia Suryanada, Jenna Travers. Congratulations to all of our Centurion Award recipients. The University of Oregon prides itself on prominent levels of student activism and involvement, and we are here today to celebrate all of your hard work. Congratulations again. I would like to take the time to recognize those who have given their indispensable support to these students. It takes much more than hard work and dedication to be successful, and your encouragement has been crucial to our students' achievements. We would also like to thank the faculty and staff who played a part in the nomination process and offer gratitude to all others who gave their time, energy, and effort to ensure this ceremony's success. Lastly, thank you to the friends and families for sharing in the celebration of these amazing students. Be well, and as always, go Ducks!